girls hiking day oh, when is the sixth day or like uh is that one 2020 2016 with the waterfalls yeah okay i've never been to that one. Oh my gosh you haven't oh my god we're going okay. We made it to Fort Collins, the Moonies, which is the family I used to nanny for. It's so good to be here. I have been with, I don't know where to sit. It's like I need lighting. I have known them since Molly was eight months old and now Molly's 11 and they have two other kids. Aubrey loves them. Me and Kelsey have been really good friends since I worked for them. This is their guest room, which is my mom is staying in. And me and Aubrey are sleeping out there on an air mattress. Abraham Hicks was amazing, amazing, but I was super tired after that workout. It's so good to see her and just like get that momentum from all the people wanting to be there to feel good. I'm super grateful I got to go see her and witness her speaking in real life. Wonderful experience, I'm so glad I went. But I'm exhausted from that hot yoga workout this morning. So we're gonna load up on dinner, enjoy ourselves here until we go to Montana. We're staying here two nights. I don't even know what day of this trip it is, but it's been great, it's been fun. I'm really grateful to be here and we're gonna go eat dinner. Hi. What you making? <laughs> um, some salad dressing. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Yum. Yeah. So hungry for good food. I know, I'm so excited. I love it's gonna be beets. delicious. I didn't uh, we have to have Can't stop eating the beets. What is this? Chicken? Plate for the buns. Where do you think I'll plate for the buns? You have the same Apple Watch. <gasps> I think I have that very same background. Face. Oh. Yeah. Very same. I like that background. I love the Apple Watch. So nice. Burger bun. That looks amazing. Yeah, oh my gosh. And here. Looks restaurant style. <laughs> Got them? <laughs> so pretty out here too. Where's Aubrey? Where's Shay? What? 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 What have you been doing? And we got salad from the garden for our dinner tonight. Yum. It's like really, really easy. It's kind of like mint, and the lemon balm like almost looks like it too. Is this mint? Uh, lemon balm. But That's it's part of the lemon balm. Yeah, go like this. It's so fun. It smells like citronella. It's like we were rubbing it. <laughs> ah. Eat it too. Oh yeah, let's do it. Lemon balm's so good for immunity. It's, oh my gosh, I love making tea. <laughs> fuzzy. <laughs> I'm just fuzzy. Mmm. Mmm. I didn't know and lemon balm was part of the mint over family. Over you want to know how you know? How? It looks like mint. So it has That's a how. square stem. It does look like mint. Show me. It has a square stem. And then okay. the leaves are alternating. They're opposite leaves. Oh, wow. And so whenever it has a square stem and alternating leaves, it's a part of the mint family. That is so cool. I had no idea. Da Abyssinalis. Look at you. <laughs> I want to take some lemon balm tea home. Really good for anxiety, actually. Yes. <clears throat> it's a nerve like, vine. It like substitutes like Xanax mm -hmm. in the herbal realm. <laughs> right? Yeah. It's really calming. Right, so we're going on a hike, me and Megan. Hi! And Katniss. Yeah. So yeah, we're gonna go on a hike. Come with us. What is this? Are you serious? What? What? What is this? This daily bread. Yes! <laughs> oh my god, it's been too long. Ariel needs to watch daily bread. That like fits perfect right there. Just be careful, I don't want to fall out. to change into pants. It's freezing this morning. It, it's crazy how cold it gets here. We are hiking. Here we go. Ah! Oh my gosh, they even got like green, like they're holographic. Like, 
the blue green sheen to them. Oh, I feel, I feel like I hear the water. Yeah. I hear be, it. It's going to be so, um, it's going to be so blowy right now with all this rain. Is that our water? Hello. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to see how deep it is. What's one thing you're grateful for today? Uh, my body. Yeah. My working body. Woo! I can walk without pain. Well, I'm a little sore, but <laughs> my body works. Yay! <laughs> think something? Katniss found something. He got smells. Oh, oh he, he found doggy. <laughs> okay, oh we're my gosh, approaching. Oh yeah, like a meadow. We were so lucky, man. You know, it was like prime time in our life this year. <laughs> So Megan, what are you grateful for? I am grateful for growth. We're in Fort Collins right now and it's been a few years since I've been here. And this is where Ariel and I met. We met in chemistry at CSU. Yes, we were talking a lot, but I've gone through a lot of changes in my life and it's so cool to see Fort Collins has too. And through those changes, we both have grown into what we are today. And I'm just so appreciative that I'm in Fort Collins right now. Yay! <laughs> Me too. It's really pretty out here. So pretty! <sighs> we just yeah. meditated by the river. Oh, it's beautiful. Pics coming soon. Pics coming. <laughs> Bet. <laughs> <laughs> and, and they were caught in 4K. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to keep up with the kid lingo. I don't know how to do no, that. No cap. No. Oh, I think, I feel like somebody said that. And I was like, what are you saying? It means no lie. Oh my no gosh. Cap. I can't stand these lingos. No cap. That. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I can't do it. So this deck right here is called Wild Woman Rising and it's so beautiful because it's elements of being really being defined in our womanhood. Oh. So we're so conditioned to be separated from that that you know certain behaviors like people pleasing can yeah. come about and so like being defined in who you are as a woman is so powerful. And so, so this is like a deck made for women. Yes exactly. So cool. Like different elements of a woman. And, and I thought it'd be good to pick a card and just like kind of think about it as oh, we're walking has, back. Like, gold on it? Yeah. <laughs> just shuffle it and then if one falls out. Oh, I feel like this one kind of popped out. How many did I yeah. pick? Three? If you want to pick three. Like I usually pick one, but oh, okay. you can pick three. 
Yeah. You want to do two? Okay, cool. <laughs> Will that one fight like a girl? Oh, that one's beautiful. Don't be afraid of your transformation. Release your old ideas and fall asleep. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, do not know that. Here, hold it. <laughs> She's helping her leave. I feel bad. I'm trying to think of a good time. I feel like I've done that before. Like, oh, yeah, dog right in the couch, man, at four. <laughs> that was the thing. I know. You're like, oh, that's what I this thing is. Gymnastics, you would do like crunches or like the bar and lift your legs up, and it would like make it tingle. Oh my god! Like, yes. did you do this? <laughs> She's having a grand old time. She is. She loves that. Release your old ideas and false beliefs as easily and naturally as a snake sheds its skin. Stand in the center of your life, even in the midst of change. Take up space without contorting or contracting to make other people more comfortable. Just told you that. It's like, would you rather hinder your energy, like deplete your own energy for somebody else? To please somebody else and no. then get deceived. Yeah. And why yeah. are you willing to do that? Especially if it's not reciprocated. But I want to know. Mm -hmm. And you need to ask yourself that. <laughs> Thanks for putting me on blast. I need you to. <laughs> You're welcome. She's friendly. And then fight like a girl. Fight like a girl. It's time to take a stand. Oh, a woman's heart in full bloom, willing to withstand the bites of thorns in order to free herself or another is a force of nature whether your fight is in your inner adv advocacy same message to clear the path of old patterns beliefs or relationships <laughs> no longer serve you to vision for the highest good of all rather than us versus them we liberate our inner hero just be just be ourselves <laughs> just enjoy them enjoy yourself so yeah. this one uh fell prowl with confidence that's pretty isn't that true for an overthinker <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> do you think that really feels good to her <laughs> Oh my god. Do we have to fix you again? Just, just like fix you again. Here. Okay. She's like, why did you stop it? <laughs> oh my god. Just stop. Guys, look at her face. She's like, she's kind of like, don't talk to me. She's mad. I know. She's pissed. She wants to go back to that. Look at her. Oh my gosh. Can you okay. not? Okay, let's hurry. <laughs> okay, so prowl with confidence. There's a beauty in confidence, and one of the ways to embody it is to allow yourself to be fully seen, exactly as you are. So it may seem counterintuitive, what makes us vulnerable is what often gets <laughs> our strength and vitality. This is so perfect right now. If we allow, if we, and they're like, aw. <laughs> Do they know what she's doing? <laughs> we gotta get you out of here. Madness! Okay. What makes you different, weird, awkward, flawed is what makes you most uniquely beautiful. Aww. Own and embody your vulnerability and then prowl through life. Knowing nothing can shame you if you already own it. When we claim all of ourselves, all blemishes and, and blunders, confidence arises from the center rather than the surface and wild woman rises. <laughs> I love that. It's less about what you wear, it's more about like how you carry yourself and you know when you get older. <laughs> oh my God. I love your like stickers. We like vibe on the stickers. We just got home from the hike. It was amazing. Amazing. I'm very tired though. We just Sorry. ate this whole bag. <laughs> I had a protein bar too. 20 G's. 20 G's. 20 G's. <laughs> Did you know bands are thousands yeah i didn't know that rubber band man until recently i'm like bands 
or like yes. a K, one K, it's a like one band. Uh, yeah, I didn't know that. <laughs> yeah, they used to say that in like the the like Ying Yang Twin era. Bands, I don't know. Ah, oh, bands make her dance. The bands make her dance. Yes, that's what it was. Bands make her dance. Okay, what were we talking awesome. about? Oh, we were talking about how when we were 20, because what? We met when we were like 23? Right, yeah. <laughs> well, here, yeah, where are you born? 91. Okay, me too. Okay. okay. <laughs> the same. Okay. So, um, are we the same year? Yeah, I'm 91, but you're November and I'm May. So, I think, yeah, we are 22-ish. Okay. So, we met in chemistry. Go Rams. Was it chemistry too? Go Rams. <laughs> <laughs> it was chem too. <laughs> and we were, Megan used to record us, or record the lecture, not us. And we would sit in the front like little dorks. <laughs> I love it. I know. I love the front row. Yeah, that's the best area. And Seriously. We would, <laughs> she would film the lecture, or re audio record the lecture, and all you could hear was us going, <laughs> <laughs> like the entire time you didn't hear one ounce of chemistry i know we so just you know. we just hit it off and when we're together we don't stop talking <laughs> but what we're talking about is how when we were 22 we used to like dress provocatively you know show the cleavage and that and the booty and the booty show everything show all the goods to attract i guess attention from men and women <laughs> yes and then now that we're 31 we want to dress for energy and we don't really we want to look classy because it's not about the cleavage. We don't want to attract people for their cleavage. We don't want to attract a man that wants our cleavage. We want to attract people for our energy. Yes. And our confidence. Yeah. And, and our aura. And that just like kind of like shines out when you are confident. You don't need the cleavage or out. the booty out because like your energy is the attraction. And yeah. then you like with that, you're attracting good vibes instead of like sleazy yes sketch yes sketch. you know just like sure. hungry men which is pretty much what what you get when your cleavage is out or your butt is out Hi. so we say we're saying we grown we grow we grown we we woman now we're mature af what's she doing she's pooped i bet she had a blast nice shirt i say your mama's Good, it's been forever. Forever, I love your candles. Oh, thank you. Yes, I got three. I I got three. I didn't know like how much you usually sell a blanket for, but I was Let me show okay. You. Cool. Awesome, awesome. I guess we'll get out. Huh. Nope. All right, let's go.